The first question I want to ask you, Gary, is how do I know if my practice can afford to add a bonus system? That is such a good question, Naren, because one of the guidelines that I shared um, in, in like a litmus test you use to check uh, whether the design of your bonus, it, it works, is number one, it must be win-win. It must be win-win. And I love this question um, because it, there are cases where it doesn't make sense to do a bonus because the practice economics are out of line, are out of line. In other words, um, the practice economics are so far out of line that there's no budget for a bonus. And if the doctor was to do a bonus, like, so well, I, I know I just want to do it out of my kindness, then it means that it's not win-win. It's not working for the doctor. But there is a, a sort of a, um, let, me, let me take a minute and kind of explain this. This is a little bit of a chicken and egg discussion, you know, which comes first, mm -hmm. the chicken or the egg, you know, that classic riddle, what comes first? Let me explain what I mean by that. But let, let me throw it in a different way, Gary. I mean, I was just thinking, you know, reading this question, you talked in the coaching and action segment, the bonus is paid from that extra revenue, right? Uh, but not always, not, not always, Darren, because okay. some, there are some, like, for example, if we're doing a starter bonus yeah. um, on Google reviews, the truth is there's no extra revenue for, for, right. um, so let me tell you, you you're, you're leading me, you know, we, we do this extemporaneously, uh, Darren and I say hi, and we hit record. Uh, so I never know what he's going to say, and he doesn't know what I'm going to say. Uh, but you're kind of leading me here, Naren, because here, you know, it's a chicken and egg discussion, because Doc, doc technically, you don't have a budget for it. Yes, I get it. But would putting a bonus in place in your practice get you to the place where you have a budget for it? And would putting a carrot out there for the team help us get there? You know, that's, that's where I use the chicken and egg analogy. So if, you know, I know some coaches that would say, absolutely, no, they're hard and fast on this. There's no bonus unless your, you know, percentage for your wages is right here. You can't ever, don't even think about putting together a bonus until you get there. And I've also seen the end results of those where they never improve on that. And they, they, they just uh, get static and they never improve. So, so let me get very specific with an answer for this particular uh, uh, listener who asked that question. Choose a starter bonus that would provide you additional revenue to be able to pay the bonus. Uh, an example that would be, you know, we talked about in the, in the example in our coaching and action segment was, you know, we pick a number of Google reviews and if they hit that, everyone get, gets X. And if they hit another number of a stretch bonus, everyone get X times two. But, but the channel, I wouldn't use that in this case. I wouldn't use that as the metric because there's no revenue that comes from that. But one we could do would be whitening, would be whitening because now we've got increased revenue you know, coming from whitening. And now you'll be able to afford to pay the bonus because you've got revenue that's funding it. And as you grow, this is found money. You weren't doing much whitening before. And as you grow, um, you're bringing in revenue that allows you to pay the bonus and improve the economics. So pick something that's tied uh, to revenue producing for that starter bonus. And, and then you can get to a point where you get that snowball rolling downhill, you get everyone, you know, uh, contributing to it. And you're strengthening your practice instead of feeling like you were stuck. Thank you so much for watching this YouTube video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to click like the full podcast episode link is below. Be sure to click that if you'd like to listen to the entire podcast episode. And most importantly, be sure to ring the bell to subscribe. That means every time we upload a new episode, you'll be the first to be notified. Thanks so much.